so I have not been as good with my YouTube videos as I want to be. I am trying to get every Sunday, but life has been a bit crazy. Um, I am currently trying to study about eight hours every day, and then I have little extra things on the side like client plans, um, my own workouts, and job stuff and becoming a real physical therapist which I'm super super excited about but my main priority needs to be my exam and when it's not I think that I really try and let everything else in my life just stop and I really need to hone in and focus because I have one month to learn everything that I have ever been taught in school and review that for one 250 question exam so I have so much anxiety about it, I freak out. But right now it's time to work out and it is my one release time of the day. I allow myself a two hour break in the middle of the day for my workouts and I go hard. I've been going really hard lately because I need it. I need the mental break and I need that physical exertion because eight hours of sitting and studying is driving me crazy. So. I'm doing legs today, glutes and hams. Um, I've been splitting up my leg days. I'm trying this new thing where I'm going three to four days on and one rest day. And I've been very bad about rest days, so I'm really trying to focus in and do that and let my body recover. And I've noticed a huge difference in the intensity and my overall workouts have been so much better. So I would highly recommend to everyone adding in a planned rest day. Um, and I've also been manipulating my diet. I'm doing a two week carb depletion before I start carb cycling to see how my body responds to that um, and see where I'm at after the end of the two weeks to kind of spike everything. Um, I'm pretty heavy right now as far as weight on the scale. Um, I do think that my physique has been changing a lot, but I've only probably dropped about five to seven pounds. Um, over the past couple of weeks um, so I have the rest of this week as a carb depletion and hopefully I look a lot better after that I also have some physique updates with these videos for you guys um, one from about a week and a half ago and then one a week later um, so it's just good to see the changes in my body that way um, so glutes and hams and I also have a back workout that I'll put in this video for you guys so Hope you like it and let me know if you have any requests. As you can see in this video, I started with an activation on the machines and I just did some wide and close grip lat pull down and then went to the cables. Um, I have super fitting lat pull down with a straight arm push down, really trying to extend my arms all the way back and really getting a squeeze of both flexion at the bottom. And then I also did a superset with triceps. Um, because triceps are the secondary muscle when you're doing a push down, and then I just finished them off um, right after I was doing the push down with the tricep extensions. The next superset I went on to was split pressures, um, and all these videos are sped up, but really with split pressures, you want to try and keep your elbows in nice and close to your body. Um, I was doing higher reps here. 
and then also trying to keep your back flat on the bench by pushing your belly button down into the bench so really making sure you're activating your core while you're doing the exercises and then I just supersetted those with a face flip bench press um, again trying to do the same thing keeping your elbows and fists together and your back flat on the bench for this workout I went back and forth between triceps and back supersets um, so I already had hit back with wide grip um, and then here you can see I'm doing a close grip um, with a neutral grip of my hands um, and really trying to get your elbows together squeezing your back behind you um, I like to do the standing on the lat machine um, just because I get a, get a different pull from a different angle um, and then here just hitting triceps again um, that's been one of my main focuses my triceps from a weakness of my last competition so I've been really trying to hit those hard um, and off season Here I'm working on the oh so dreaded pull ups. I'm absolutely awful at pull ups, but um, doesn't stop me from trying. So I'm doing assisted pull ups here, wide grip. I like to do them in the middle of my workout just because I have already have good back activation and I think I get a better mind muscle connection after I've already warmed up with a few other exercises first. Really trying to bring your chest to the bar, squeeze elbows together, back together, up at the top. Next, I went into a seated row. Um, you can see the grip here. I think when I use a close grip handle, I can't get a full contraction of my lats because I can't bring my elbows all the way together behind my back. So I like using this grip. Um, I start in a pronated position and I go into supination, turning my palm upwards in order to get full better contraction and really squeeze towards your elbow, your elbows together towards behind your back. And here I did um, the pyramid decline set. So I started with a heavier weight and then I went down and just repped out um, with every weight that I could, the max amount of reps that I could. Here, I was just kind of trying to reactivate my triceps. I've had a lot of difficulty activating my triceps, and I pick on other muscles like my shoulders and lats. So in the middle of my workouts are times I'm just feeling difficulty activating my triceps. I try and incorporate some band work, such as what you see right here. And then I'm just going right into tricep pushdown. Switching the grip, I do pushdowns with, I try almost every grip, um, switch it up all the time. Trying to hit every head of your triceps really hard. Squeezing full contraction, straightening your arms slow on the way up. And supersetting with the seated dip machine. Just another angle to hit more of the upper back um, rhomboids and little traps here. Clearly that's an awful angle, but um, I have a row machine grip. And then just supersetting with a final little um, fatigue for my triceps. I hit it from both angles to hit both heads of the tricep, as I said before. And then you can see I'm using my other hand to just give a little bit of assistance on my way back up again. And I ended with a row machine and some abs. Really been trying to hit my abs. I've been awful at it, but trying to get a little bit every day. And then I also put some posing in at the end. Um, so please like and subscribe and let me know if you guys have any questions or any requests for videos that you would like to see. And again, I apologize for being MIA for so long, but I'm back and I promise I will make more videos again very, very soon.